Bitcoin rose above $61,000 during Asian trading hours, remaining largely within the $59,000 to $61,000 range over the past two weeks. Traders are now looking to the Federal Reserve's annual Jackson Hole Symposium scheduled for later, later Friday for potential market-moving comments. Major cryptocurrencies like Ethereum, Solana, BNB, and XRP saw minimal changes, moving less than 2% in 24 hours. The Coindesk 20, or CD20, which tracks the largest tokens by market capitalization, increased by 1.7%. Notably, Cardano rose by 3%, and Avalanche jumped 10% after being integrated into Franklin Templeton's on-chain U.S. Government Money Market Fund, or FOBXX. Bitcoin Exchange Traded Funds, ETFs, in the U.S. saw $64 million in inflows, extending a six-day streak, with BlackRock's IBIT leading at $75 million. However, the slower rate of inflows is considered bearish by some. In contrast, Ethereum's ETFs continued their record outflow streak, losing over $800,000 on Thursday, with cumulative outflows exceeding $458 million since their launch in July. Market participants are keenly watching Fed Chair Powell's speech for clues on future rate cuts, which could impact risk assets like Bitcoin. Some remain cautious, anticipating potential disappointment if rate cuts aren't confirmed. And if you're looking at trying to do what's called leverage trading or margin trading, it's an opportunity where you could potentially be making a lot more money. There's an exchange called Margex, and there is a link down in the description below. They have no KYC. That means that if you want to get started, it only takes about 30 seconds, one minute to create an account. And over here for certain crypto like XRP, you could go as high as 50X. But for other cryptos like Bitcoin and Ethereum, you can go as high as 100X. You can also do regular crypto trades. You can buy crypto here. They even have this copy trading tab so you can see how other people are performing. All you do is provide up collateral. You can mirror their trades, set up autopilot one click. It's super quick, it's super easy and you can claim up to $10,000 in bonuses. So if you wanna look into this more, if you wanna get started, you can find that link down in the description below. Just keep in mind, it's available in a lot of regions, but if it's not available in your region, some people may decide to use a VPN, that choice is obviously up to you. Meanwhile, XRP is heading into the weekend with a nearly 7% gain, marking a bullish trend that has caught the attention of top crypto analysts. The token's price has returned to the 60 cent level, a point it last reached earlier this year before market volatility driven by geopolitical uncertainties pushed it lower. The current rally aligns with the broader narrative surrounding XRP, which is potentially on the verge of its biggest price breakout in history. This speculation is fueled by a massive bullish triangle pattern that has been forming since 2018. The last time XRP showed such a pattern, it skyrocketed nearly 60,000% in just over 300 days. However, a repeat of this massive surge is unlikely, given XRP's current market cap of over $30 billion. A similar increase would push its valuation into the trillions, which seems unrealistic, especially when compared to Bitcoin's $1.21 trillion market cap. Despite this, both major, uh, both major analysts and enthusiasts remain optimistic about XRP's growth potential. As the seventh largest cryptocurrency, XRP's future movements will be closely watched by the market. I would love to know what you guys think about this. Looking at the charts here, while I'm recording this video, XRP is just a little bit below that 60 cent level, but overall, it's right on that very key level right back here. We actually had that establishment, um, that establishment already set up. So if it can manage to make a further rally, I think the biggest catalyst that would cause it to do that would be the results with what happens with Jerome Powell. So keep an eye out for that meeting, guys. I will try to keep you up to date the best that I can. And let me know what you think about all this down in the comments below. And again, you can go check out the crypto exchange Margex if you want to research it, if you want to get started. That link is down in the description below.
Thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. A double shout out thank you to Victor Vegas being a higher level patron. My YouTube members for your support as well. God bless and we'll see you in the next episode.